So the polls are closed and now we have some results for the 11 ridings that are in the general Edmonton area in the 2019 federal election. So there were three ridings that we were watching very closely tonight. One of them was Edmonton Strathcona. And that riding was held for 11 years by Linda Duncan, who chose to retire. She was the NDP MP. And uh, so tonight was a race between Heather McPherson for the NDP and challenger Sam Lilly from the Conservatives. And it was the closest race that we saw in the city tonight. Uh, as, as of now, with most polls reporting, Heather McPherson does appear to be the victor, so the NDP will hold that riding. But it is the only federal riding in all of Alberta's 34 that is not a conservative riding. And that was what the interesting result was tonight for Alberta, is that in a liberal minority parliament, we have no liberal MPs and no seat necessarily at the cabinet table held by a member of parliament from Alberta. Uh, the other seats we were watching closely were the existing or uh, incumbent Liberal MPs in Edmonton. One of those was uh, Amarjeet Sohi. He was the Minister of Infrastructure and Communities. He was a high-profile minister, especially on the pipeline file. Where Was the Trans Mountain expansion ever going to get approved in Canada? He was the one that was often tagged to speak for that file in Alberta. He lost his seat tonight in Edmonton Will Woods and he lost it to Tim Uppel, who was a cabinet minister in former Prime Minister Stephen Harper's government. He is now back representing Edmonton. And the other riding we were watching very closely was Edmonton Centre, which was represented by Randy Boisineau. And Randy was a special advisor to Prime Minister Justin Trudeau on LGBTQ issues. He was defeated tonight by James Cumming, who was a challenger for him last time. James Cumming is from the Conservative Party. And the rest of Alberta was a thorough blue sweep. Uh, many MPs who were elected as first-time Conservative MPs in the Edmonton area will be returning to the House of Commons. Uh, along with longtime MP Mike Lake, who represents Edmonton, Wetaskiwin.